Okay guys, Combat Tactics 101, the Crescent Shark. This is quite a unique enemy in my eyes and I'm going to tell you exactly why. So first things first about this guy and this enemy is he's not vulnerable to any element whatsoever. He's not vulnerable to it and he's highly resistant to electricity damage. And when he hits you, he can inflict elemental vulnerability. This takes down all your resistances, say like your decay resistance, your frost resistance, electric resistance, fire resistance, ice resistance, they all get taken down by minus 25% when he hits you with elemental vulnerability. So you don't want to get hit by that, it is a nasty hex, but the easiest way to get rid of that hex is either by waiting out the timer for it to go, or you can just use a simple hex cleanser, I don't think I've got one on me, no I don't, but you can just use a hex cleanser and that will get rid of the hex. So first things first, the beautiful thing about this enemy, it's just got one single move. It's like a front forward, like a round circular tornado, a front forward move. It's just like it'll swirl and push forward. Now you've got like a second gap to get a parry or a brace in there. It's not hard to do at all. And these moves, what he does is just easily sidestep, side roll, side run. It's not a hard enemy to fight at all once you know what you're doing and the tactics and stuff. But yeah, so like I say, he's highly resistant to thunder damage and stuff. And he's got no vulnerabilities whatsoever. So just a simple ice varnish, ice rag or anything. Actually, just use a fire rag or something, you know. You don't need a varnish on your weapon, depending on if it's not decent or not. But if it's a good weapon, then, yeah, you don't need a varnish on it. It's just a bit overkill. So here we go. These are very fast, agile creatures. So if you're wearing heavy armor and you try to outrun them, it's not going to work. I promise you that now, because these are fast. Look, I'll show you the speed in a minute. I'll get running. Let, let him notice me first. Look, there it is. Do you see, like, the, the sort of curl, forward curl motion, like a hook? It's like a forward, then hook. There it is. Again, it'll swirl around. Easily dodged. Look, it's, it's barely got any range to it as well, look, as you can see. Look, there's your chance for a kick right there after he does the move. Very easily done. You can't do shit. And that's that. Right, anyway, wait for an opening. There it is. Chance to parry. Wait for another one. There it is again, hit a brace. There's your chance to jump on top and capitalize on that and just finish him off. That's all you've got to do, guys. Simple tactics. They're not hard enemies at all. They're just like burning men, except for they just do a swirl instead of fucking fire and stuff. It's just as easy as the burning man.